Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome to uh, tonight's quick little video that I thought I would put together for you guys because um, I got my BoxyCharm today and you probably have all watched BoxyCharm unboxings. They're probably a little annoying. I don't know. Some people like to watch them. Um, I generally won't watch the... I generally won't watch a boxy charm unboxing until I've already gotten my box because I don't want the spoiler alert, you know, I don't want to know what I'm going to get in my box, like, who would want to know, like, I don't want to know, I want to be surprised because it's like always an exciting thing knowing boxy charms on its way or my ipsy bag, there's, you know, nothing better than opening up a present and not knowing what it is so it's kind of the same idea but anyway I had to do a video because this this month's box kind of blew my socks off um, so to speak because I so I opened up the box obviously we get the little card in here that tells you like what products are in here how much you know how much they retail for and I added up the um, the prices of all the products and it came up to $251 like what so I paid $25 a month for the box the subscription and um, they do have boxy lux where you can get like a bigger box but I really don't see any point in getting boxy lux because unless you don't buy makeup you know unless you don't go to Ulta or buy drugstore makeup um, or Sephora like I just don't see the point in paying I think it's like 40 some dollars I could be wrong I don't really know but it's just boxycharm $25 a month is definitely worth it because you get five to six um, full-size products um, brand name high-end products and I just think it's worth it because I use a lot of what I get and if I don't use it I gift it um, or donate it but um, you know I have daughters and you know, I think I gave my mom a couple things. Um, my sister-in-law, I gave my sister-in-law a couple things. So it comes in handy because definitely if you can't use something, like why not re-gift it? I mean, it might sound a little bit cheap. I don't know, but I mean, if somebody gave me makeup, free makeup um, as a gift, I skincare, bubble baths, bath bombs, Epsom salts, like I'm all about that life. Sorry for the, the, there's a little bit of a glare because um, I have my mini ring light on, but I couldn't see anything like in order to read like the descriptions of all this stuff, I had to put some extra lights on. So anywho, so let's see. Okay, so the first product that I saw was that, stu you know, stood out is the Too Faced Diamond Light. Um, Diamond Light, and this is in the shade Fancy Pink diamond this is super cute um i have something exactly it's not the exact same but i grabbed it because i thought oh my god i have this exact same thing this is really cute you guys like it's it's a little box it's like a gift box almost and then it says um it's your time to shine and then it's got this little box inside kind of like a ring box and it's got the little button to open it little gold button so you push that you don't even have to push it you literally just lift it um and this is it's like a pink iridescent let's see pink iridescent um highlight can you kind of see the pinky it's like a pinky peachy iridescent highlight um super pretty it's super pretty it's really pretty um this retails for i was really surprised that we got that um this retails for 36 dollars so you know it's a little pricey it paid your box off um, but anyway when I got this I was like oh man I think I already have one of those so this is the one that I have um, and so you could see the difference like so this is the one boxycharm scent and this is the one that I already had and this one says the exact same thing the only difference is it doesn't say pink 
This one doesn't say fancy pink. This one is um, different. It has the like same, exact same um, saying, it's your time to shine, the same box. And you open it up and it's just a like white iridescent. So it's like really pretty. So if you hold up the two together, you can clearly see um, the difference. And these boxes are just so freaking adorable. Like I love these boxes. It's like he went to Jared. Okay, so you can see the difference. So clearly one is pink iridescent and one is the like pearl, almost like I say like a white pearl iridescent. You can use these on your inner corners. You can use it on your brow bone. You can use it for highlight. You can use it for the center of your lid for like you literally can use any highlighter anywhere on your face that you want on your chest I like to put um, let's see I like to put highlight right on my collarbones because they're so prominent see how they like shine and then especially in the summertime I like to do this and um, I'll put it like on my shoulders like in the summertime and it just looks really pretty. Put a little bit on your chest. Um, it just looks really pretty. If I have my hair up, I'll put it like on the back of my neck. Um, you can really put it anywhere you want. <laughs> okay, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Um, so that's really cool. Like I'm really excited for that. I really need to use this more. I've had this for over a year and I, I think I've used it twice and I just don't reach for it very much because again, it's kind of gimmicky, you know, it's cute. The box is cute. It's just like, it's super cute, but um, I'm going to try to use it more and I'm also going to use this. Um, and if I find that I'm not using like one or the other, if I'm just not getting into it, then I'll re-gift one of them just because I like to share, you know. So let's see, next up, I got to put my readers on. Sorry. Do men make passes to women who wear glasses? Do they? I just heard that somewhere. <laughs> I'm like a, I look like a librarian. Well, I just need to put my hair up in a bun. Okay. Next up is Dr. Brandt Skincare 24 seven retinal eye cream. All eyes are on you with this potent. Let me just tell you, wait, let me just tell you what this diamond light says it's pretty long this says this one-of-a-kind highlighter is infused with real crushed diamond powder and light reflecting pearls for a brilliant fancy pink diamond glow that will have you on planet shimmer light up your complexion with pure pink radiance in a silky powder formula by swirling the dual tone opalescent shades together to create an F Ethereal, I don't know, I could be saying it wrong. Ethereal custom glow all its own. Each highlighter is created with our unique marble pouring technique, ensuring no two highlighters will ever look the same. Who knew? Just like a real diamond. So diamonds, there's no two diamonds that are alike. Um, so I guess these two diamonds are different in their own way. Um, so who knew? I didn't know that there was like real diamond powder. I mean, I should have it tested. I think I'm going to take it to the jeweler and have them test it. I'm going to do that because I, that's just what I do. Okay. Okay. So the Dr. Brandt, um, Dr. Brandt skincare 24 seven retinol eye cream. All eyes are on you with this potent yet gentle light reflecting and age fighting eye cream, a perfect combination of retinol and ruby crystal complex that gives your eyes the attention they deserve. So, I am super excited to use this. Do you guys know how much this retails for? You're not gonna believe it. $55, like 55 US dollars. Oh, sorry, my camera's like tilted. Sorry, it's like doing something weird right now. It's like the light is breathing. Do you see that? Oh. That was weird. I know you guys saw that. It looked like the light was breathing. Oh God, I'm scaring myself. Okay, where was I? 
Okay, yeah, so, okay, um, all eyes are on you, da 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 da. Illuminating the eye contour helps smooth away lines, helps reduce moisture loss. So, I'm excited to use this, $55, that's kind of crazy. Um, next up we have Skin & Co, Skin & Co Roma. And this is a polishing micro exfoliating truffle face gommage. What the hell's gommage? Gommage, it sounds like Italian. Um, okay, well, you know what? It just might be. A delicate exfoliating cream with a rich texture and soothing fragrance, Truffle Therapy Face Gommage is a lush formula combining the best of the iconic Mediterranean lifestyle and a lux luxury Italian spa experience. Hey. Uh, let's see, a beauty cabinet staple, the Truffle Therapy Face Gommage features sweet almond oil, gentle apricot seed powder, and our unique exclusive black winter truffle extract, which has a high concentration of superoxide dismutase. I don't know, I'll have to Google that. Um, a powerful free radical scavenger. <laughs> Yo, a scavenger that reduces the signs of aging. Gently buff away and erase dull, black, luster skin, revealing a more luminous and healthy complexion. And this retails for $28. So for all that, this one should be the $55 instead of the Dr. Brand. But uh, I'm gonna give it a go. I'm gonna use this to exfoliate my skin before bed. Instead, I'm gonna put my other skin night, night routine aside and I'm going to use the 24 seven um, retinol eye cream. And I think this is the AM and a PM. You can use the AM and PM. Yeah, AM and PM. So I'm gonna try this, $55, wow. Okay, so next up we have the Avant Shea Butter Rice Brand Pathanol poly, polydecine, polydecine, poly, let's see. Sorry guys, I'm not like the best at pronouncing things. So, okay, so this is an eight hour radiance renewal sleeping mask. Cool, because I do a sleeping mask every night after I do my skincare. I do um, the Laneige Lavender Sleep Mask and I kind of alternate. Um, it's really calming, you know, lavender is obviously calming. And, or I'll do my, um, the Origins sleep mask in the green tube. Should have brought it down, but amazing. Super, super hydrating. And I swear by it. I've repurchased it three times and a little goes a long way. It lasts a really long time, but it's worth it. It's like $32. It's not, it's kind of expensive, I guess, if you, you know, if it's not drugstore, but it's definitely worth it. It's not a hundred and $55 or $107 like it literally is worth it and so I'm going to use this sleep mask so let me just see here okay eight hour radiance renewal sleeping mask works to reveal more youthful and beautiful skin overnight it also helps to tighten the skin and lessen the appearance of wrinkles and fine lines okay this retails for $107 that's insane so to be able to keep up, like, is it, let's say we like this product. Let's say, uh, hopefully a little bit this goes a long way. Um, you know, to, also to extend, like, to, in order to, like, maybe, you know, make your products last longer, especially in, like, a tube like this or something like this. Um, this is specifically for your eyes. So, I mean, I wouldn't waste this on your face anywhere, but... Um, what I like to do with my serums and my moisturizers, especially my serums and moisturizers, is I'll get a little drop of serum or oil, rose oil, whatever oils I'm using, whatever serums I'm using. Then I'll also use like a drop or two of my moisturizer. And then I get, I use chopsticks because I, that's just what I use. I just took them from the, every time we get Chinese food, I will keep the chopsticks. So. And then I'll just get the chopstick and stir it in my hand and I make little cocktails. That's what I call them, they're cocktails. And so when you have a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little bit of that, you've got a nice good quarter size of face treatments and and just, I mean, it really extends, it, it's super hydration, it's just like a power, it's like a power uh, surge of different antioxidants and moisturizers and hydration, like I love doing that. So. 
Um, anyway, okay, so this is, like I said, $107. Avant Shea Butter Rice Brand 8 Hour Radiance Renewal Mask. So I'm going to try this tonight. I'm going to put my other sleeping mask aside and give this a try um, and see. I'm going to do this probably for a few days and see you know, if it plumps and decreases. I don't have a ton of wrinkles. I mean, I have a couple little lines here. You know, obviously have some little bit of lines around here. Um, not super bad um, considering, you know. Um, I try really hard. I, I keep up with my skincare. I really, I don't go to bed with my makeup on ever, ever. Um, I think the worst that I've ever done or do is just like using makeup wipes because I'm so tired and I just want to get the makeup off and I know that I'm not cleansing and that bothers me and I know that I'm getting all that dirt and stuff out of my pores but then the next morning I will really double up on my skincare and my cleansing and exfoliating and toning so um, I really really put a lot of good products on my skin um, you know, you can get drugstore stuff too. I do have drugstore products that I use. Um, the number seven is really good. That's drugstore, but it's also pretty high priced. Like, I think I paid like $27 for one of my eye creams like this, but a little goes a long way with that also. And when I'm incorporating like all these different things, my products last a lot longer because I'm using so many things and you want to make sure they all go together. You know, you don't want to just be putting like a bunch of different oils and things that are just going to counteract each other like make sure that they all are going to give you some type of benefit but I you know I just think that it's so important for us to take care of our skin and you know especially as we're getting older like in the aging process like we want to grow old gracefully you know I want to get some more um, injections actually I don't have fillers but I do want to get fillers because I do have a lot of like crepiness under my under eyes like you can't see it really like I can see it, but you know, my, my concealer does settle sometimes in my fine lines. Um, you know, so we can all use a boost here and there, but I do want to get some fillers. Um, I think within the next year and, um, I do want to get some more lip injections cause that's pretty much worn off. I've lost a lot of pigment. Like this is all lip. Like my lips look really small. I do have small lips, but all this is like lip. And I've lost a lot of pigment in my lips right here and like right over around here. So unless I line my lips, like really like my lips look like they're just really, really thin. But I mean, they are, but they're not as thin as they really are. So that's kind of why I wear lipstick, you know, is because I can line them and then it, you can really see my lip. But when I'm wearing gloss, it's kind of hard to tell. But anyway, uh, let's move on. Okay, so the next and last item is um, this Grand, this Grand Cosmetics um, Intense Thickening Mascara, designed to designed by the maker of cult favorite Grand Lash MD Lash Enhancing Serum. Grand Cosmetics introduces the hottest secret weapon for lashes that command attention. Grand Drama Intense Thickening Mascara with Castor Oil. Okay, so castor oil is supposed to be really good for your hair growth on your eyes. Like if you get like um, maybe a little tiny brush and just get castor oil, actually castor oil, and just kind of rub it on your lash line. Um, I haven't done that yet just because I didn't really feel like I needed to. Oh, let me finish reading this. Um, the No Flake, so it doesn't flake, which is good. The Intense Black Formula works while you wear it creating um, unriveled thickness through key ingredient castor oil. And this retails for $25. So it's kind of a lot for a mascara. It's kind of like the Better Than Sex mascara, um, which you can get the Lash Paradise and it's the exact same thing. Um, and I think it's like $10 or something like that. But I had to do an unboxing with this box because $251 worth of product was a little bit crazy. Now, I don't know that this Avant is worth $107 like I mean ingredients are everything and I mean I just that's a lot like so like I said to keep up with all this like if say this works for you and to keep up with it you know 
$107 to dish out is a lot of money. Like it literally is a lot of money. These ingredients are so tiny that I could not read them even with my reading glasses. I mean, it'll take me a minute, but I'm gonna just give it a try. This is the sleep mask. I just wanna see how it makes my skin feel. If, it, if it's, you know, the way that the Origins and the Laneige sleep mask work, then, you know, it's great. Um, but I'm gonna continue using what works for me and the Origins is a really good product. Um, if you haven't tried the Origins, any of their products, um, I suggest you try um, Clinique is also a good brand that's affordable it's not drugstore but it's also it's it's high-end but it's not like $107 like I have the Clinique take the day off oil remover face oil makeup remover that's really good and I think I paid I don't know 25 30 dollars for it um, um, the moisture I have the Hydra it's like Hydra jelly um, Clinique Hydra jelly that's a really good um, hydrating face um, serum almost in a, in a bottle I like to keep it in the refrigerator I keep a lot of my serums and moisturizers in the refrigerator in my little mini refrigerators I finally got two pink ones so um, I have the black one I gave to my granddaughter so um, I like to keep all my serums and stuff it just extends the shelf life of them and it feels good when you put it on your skin especially in the morning I keep my jade rollers in the refrigerator um, I've really been using those I'm proud of myself because I wasn't using them and if they're good when you put your serums on and they're cold like in the morning especially when you, I have like dark circles because I do get dark circles right here and a little bit of puffiness so it's just really good I do the roller over my entire face just to de puff and it also helps to circulate the blood um, where it settles in your face like the capillaries and stuff it just kind of clears it out if you have discoloration hyperpigmentation like me you know I have a lot of like freckles and spots and stuff that I would rather not have but you know I take care and maintain my skin the best I can don't forget your necks when you're whatever you're putting on your face make sure you're doing your neck your decollete and you always want to go upward this is your decollete um, and you always want to go upward with everything as much as you can you know as much as you can on your face with your creams and serums obviously when we're putting our makeup on we can't really like go up on everything but you always want to as much as possible go up and you know don't tug too much around your eyes because super thin around our eyes the fact that our under eyes are the same as the skin on the backs of our hands this might be a little bit thicker but for the most part we have the same skin so you want to take care of that use your ring finger when applying any of your creams your serums anything around your eyes um, I don't like to have my nails really long like this um, I used to have them way longer for like 20 some years and I would type like fast but all you could hear was like clicking and I'm sure my coworkers hated it but using your ring finger um, is the best for anything around your eyes um, you can also do like a little eye massage too like if you're putting your serums on you know just go around like go around your entire eye and just like pat and it's just a really good eye massage and it kind of breaks up where that blood settles right here because that's really what dark circles are is a blood settling so it's kind of weird kind of creepy but yeah so anyway you guys I hope you enjoyed this little unboxing um, I just thought that it was <laughs> crazy that it was $251 worth of product and the fact that one of these products was $107 and this one was $55 so I mean your box is paid let me tell you your box is paid off with this mascara right like this mascara retail for what is it $25 and that's how much the box is so $25 for this and you got another what did I say $251 did I say $251 yeah I think I did right $251 or $250 $251 $250 is what it came out to and that's insane so anyway guys leave your comments questions and suggestions for me down below let me know if you guys have this if you like it or if you've tried any of these products let me know what you think and um yeah i think that's gonna do it for tonight's video and i look forward to seeing you guys in my next one give this video a like if you liked it share my channel please subscribe if you have not already 
and that way you don't miss out on future good stuff that I have you know coming I'm gonna be making some brownies infused with THC CBD and I'm also gonna do some cornflake marshmallow treats kind of like Rice Krispie treats you make them the exact same way um, and then I'm going to infuse like a half of the batch of those with a light I'm not gonna put a whole lot because this stuff is strong like really strong and it's actually a coconut oil so it's a THC CBD coconut oil you can um, you can put it on if you're aching anywhere, your knees, your back, cramping. You could put it on your stomach, rub it on with a get a glove or something, and um, rub it on and then put a heating pad over it, on your neck, anywhere where you're hurting. Um, so what I do like at night is I'll make a cup of tea, like chamomile or sleepy time or echinacea tea, um, ginger, whatever. And then I'll put a little bit of, I have some ham honey. Um, so I'll put like a little bit of ham honey in it and um, about a quarter of a teaspoon of the CBD THC stuff because that stuff is strong. So I took, I had a, a cup of tea one night and I did like a, just like a quarter of a teaspoon and I'm like, well they told me to take like a teaspoon of it. Man, if I would have took a teaspoon of it, I probably would have slept for like two or three days. But I did a quarter of a teaspoon drank a tea and then a couple hours later I'm like you know what I think I want another cup of tea before I go to bed so I made another cup of tea the same amount of of the oil the coconut oil mixed it in I was out I actually because it's got THC and CBD so I have a THC CBD strain which is super strong and then I have a um, well I have two of those and then I have another jar that has a little bit of THC and a whole lot of CBD so um, yeah so just gauging it I have an idea now I know what it, what anyway so I pretty much woke up high which wasn't a bad thing but I was like I couldn't do anything that day like I was like um homebound today because I woke up high I stayed high for about an hour I was super relaxed it, it wasn't a bad thing trust me I took a hot bath I was just like Zen. I was just like in a zone and let me tell you when you have anxiety and depression and pain this stuff is amazing. I've tried so many different CBD products, THC, uh, smoking, I have a vape pen, um, I've got my edibles, I keep a stock of everything and um, all the stuff that I've tried works great but this CBD THC coconut oil that I got from a relative and let me tell you this is probably about about nine hundred dollars worth of um, stuff and she gave she gifted it to me she gifted it to me because her dad was dying of cancer and a really aggressive cancer and he was in a lot of pain and one of the relatives is in the cannabis industry and like my daughter and um, but they make it and stuff and they sell it I think in I want to say Pueblo I think in Pueblo um, but anyway so she gifted it to me because I tried it it worked great she's like girl I'm gonna let me give it to you because it helped my dad and if it helps you this is the one thing that I'm not saying it's curing me but I think that it's in the process of curing me um, but it's gotten me through some very very painful attacks and let me tell you my attacks almost send me to the emergency room but I know that you know they're gonna pass and I know that you know I can maintain it and I can treat it and I just have to get through that those couple hours of the intense pain that takes your breath away literally I think I've almost fainted multiple times but you know I already know what to do I you know I put cold wet towels on myself I drink cold water I do the heating pad I take whatever I need to take and it sucks sometimes but I appreciate the good days today was a good day I want to say hi to my friend Carmen we went to school together um, I know this video was about boxy charm but let me just quickly say this um, we went to junior high together. I met her um, in like seventh grade. I think I was like 14. And um, her brother and my brother were best friends. Well, my brother Mark, who died, um, he, you know, obviously um, died in 1983. And her brother just passed away. So they were best friends. And her brother just passed away um, a couple years ago. And super sad. Um, 
like he was like the best guy I just loved him and um, but I had lunch with her today we've been trying to get together and the last time we had a plan I was sick of course um, but you know God's perfect timing everything has a timing and today we just had an amazing talk it was so good to see her. it was so refreshing and we caught up there we still have like so much to talk about so much to catch up on like I was 14 we were 14 I'm 54 she'll be 54 I mean that's how many years it's been since I've seen her so to catch up and hear about like all these people who died that I didn't know and all these people that got murdered and I mean sick people are sick and it's just was so sad it was just so like wow like I wonder what happened to all these people because I don't keep in I never kept in touch with anybody from school or any of that part of my life at all like nobody so it was really really nice to have lunch with you Carmen I love you you're just you're the best she sends me messages all the time and sometimes I get caught up with my pain and stuff and then I'm like, crap, like I haven't messaged her. And then she'll send a message, a quote, just have a beautiful day, my friend. And you know, I love you, God bless you, and thinking of you. And it just means so much to me because because I don't have, you know, a lot of friends. Um, and she was just, she's a real genuine. Like we went to lunch, I didn't touch my phone, she didn't touch her phone. I mean, and we just were just interacting and it was just so nice, so refreshing. To have each other's undivided attention is so rare and I loved it and I can't, I'm so excited for our next lunch. So I love you, Carmen. Thank you so much. God bless you. And she's amazing. She's like an amazing lady. Uh, she does a lot. She's super strong. So anyway, you guys, that's going to do it for today's video. And um, I will look forward to seeing you in my next one.